Well, all right, all right, all right. Welcome to another one about my stumps. World of Tanks Xbox 360 replays. We're in the Tiger 2. We are on the new Al Hadoof. And, um, we're going to go where the heavy should go. Unlike the other Tiger 2 on our team and the T32 on our team who sit in the middle and do nothing and pretty much I think cost us a game even when I was on mic saying you know I need your help over here you two t heavies in the meat in the middle if you come over and help we'll be able to hold this nope they still sit right in the middle and then of course once everyone's dead then they move down in the middle and get killed but that's how it goes on World of Tanks I uh, logged on tonight to play a few games and I got through, I don't know, maybe five before I said screw it. It was just idiot team after idiot team after idiot team. Uh, just In this game, the whole team wasn't an idiot team. Um, I didn't look behind me to see exactly which ones, but there's a couple of E75s I believe that follow me over here. And they do good. Um, I'm not sure who else. I'll have to look at the end. But we held this side as long as we could. And, you know, if we had just a little bit of help, a little bit more help from the other heavies on the ten in the team, instead of them sitting at D6 and 7, D7, the whole game, them two sat right there. It's a T32 and a Tiger 2. They never moved until the very end. Because they're complete morons. So, uh, yeah, they got quite a bit of tanks over here. And there's some tier 9s. And, uh, IS-3, which, sitting behind that other dead carcass, I'm never going to penetrate him. Of course, I throw one over there, I believe, if I remember right, just to see. And there's another one, two IS-3s. But I knew I wasn't going to penetrate that. That just wasn't going to happen. But I'm going to sit here and side scrape anyways. Is that Tiger 2 jump out there? And I'm going to take the shots that I can. You know, take what it gives me, and hopefully, hopefully the people behind me, you know, can help out enough to to uh, defend the the edge back here. We stick one in that T34 a second ago, and we're going to track this uh, Tiger. Hopefully, to keep him there and allow a teammate to pound on him. I take my first damage right there from the 103. IS-3 coming up. Ooh, and then I'm going to stick back out again. Got to put another one through him. Put another one through that Tiger. And pull up here as far as I can. I want to give him nothing but just the, just the sides of my tracks. Bounce off that T-32, which I should have finished him off. I'd backed up just a little bit to take that shot. I would have got a better angle on him and finished him. I'm going to track that tiger again. And I've tra I track him, I think, probably four times in this game. And I would think that the team would be able to take advantage of it behind me. But uh, I'm tracked right now, and there's nothing I can do at the moment. But just take the shots I can take. Hopefully my track gets back up. This guy just isn't going to back up, but we're going to finish him off. And they're just they're just pushing hard. You know what I mean? They're, I'm in a good position, but they're slowly just killing everyone behind me, so. And you notice, oh, one of them, after I was on mic complaining, moved out of that spot. But the other one's still sitting right up there. And he didn't move very far, I don't think. I think this one just backed up some to see if he could get some shots over there from trying to wiggle. Let's see if I can keep shots bouncing. I'm going to stick one in that IS-3 and fix my track that time because there, there's so many right there and they're so close now. That shot wasn't going to work. So I'm going to wait take his track off but 
the tanks behind me must be they must be damaged pretty bad because uh, they're not shooting anymore I track him and like I said I'm the only one firing at this point and this is that tiger right there is going to get me but he just tracks I finish him off and I catch on fire I put it out but I don't have much life left here I'm pretty much dead put another one to that IS-3 come on I get another shot off here another one into that tiger I'm surprised my teammates were not able to take out that tiger I mean I just don't understand it there's two heavy and see then the two heavies back at C7 again doing absolutely nothing just sitting in the middle I've said help I said it on mic and they take me out and that's pretty much the end after that the uh, tank that was behind me just say uh, you know, he gets overrun but as you'll see oh well, there goes one down with the hill T32 I'm gonna take off now and do nothing freeze turkeys sat there and did absolutely nothing the whole game I think he ends up with 200 damage I think and then the Tiger 2 still sit up there still sitting at C7 I'm gonna sit right up here until every tank comes up around me it's the mentality of these idiots it's it just baffles me how even when people on the mic saying yo we need help over here or the f the flank is gonna fall and then they're gonna be up around and they're gonna kill you if you don't come over and help you know if we have five guns over here it's much better than three guns nope they just sit right there and he's still looking uh, Dave MBE I'm just gonna sit here look over the hill you know, something might come out in front of oh there something's coming out in front of me I tell him on my go there you go there's a shot oh and you miss oh you did a lot of good there sitting there and I think he dies in this position. He never moves. I'm pretty sure that T30 makes it all the way up around and kills him, if I'm not mistaken. I'm pretty sure I switch to someone else here. Oh, here's I go and yeah, I've been doing this a little bit lately. When you get idiots like this, I don't even do player skill because it doesn't reflect on their their uh, gamer score and everything anymore. If you do, uh, if you do player skill and just lacking skill, all it does it doesn't do anything. So, I uh, on the really bad ones. You know, if you get a few players that don't know what they're doing, lower tiers, I don't do this. But when you're at tier eight and nine, and you're such a moron that even when people are trying to tell you, hey, you need to do this, we need your help, and they don't, nope, I'm gonna shit right here and do nothing. You know, yeah, I'm gonna mark him an idiot on their on their page. Oh, what's that over there? Oh, it's not a T30. Oh, uh, the T30 ends up killing him, but the one off to the side there, I thought that was a T30 for some reason. But uh, yeah, they just complete morons. This guy did good, and this T32, eh, I. At least he moved. Of course, he waited till almost the end of the game. But they just... The actual... Both T-32s, this guy and the other guy, really didn't help whatsoever. Freeze turkey. I just... I just... You want to get on mic and yell at him. You want to get on mic and say, Are you guys this stupid that even when someone's saying, Hey, we need your help over here all their tank not all their tanks but most of their tanks are over here you're doing nothing in the middle of the map come help nope they're just gonna sit right there I'm surprised that that uh, Tiger 2 turret moved that quick that was a uh, I thought for sure he'd be able to out, outrun that Tiger 2 turret 
but apparently not. But there's our Nodka Nodak 33. Oh, I'm gonna go up the hill now. Let's see if I can get a shot. Maybe I can climb this hill and they won't see me anymore. Oh, whoops, wait a minute, they're capping. Hmm. Oh, crap. Oh, double crap. It's just... It's a fitting end to this idiot. Good job, Tiger 2. But, um... <coughs> excuse me. I was going to do this video for a fail team, but the team didn't really fail, just like half the team. Half the team did good, so I end up with a 95% ace, I mean 95% master, sniper medal, 50,600 on a loss in silver, 2300 XP on a loss, and I only had two kills. I, I I did my part in this game. Ended up with 3,700 damage, 565 spotting damage, or assisted damage, two kills. I shot 22 shots, 22 hits, and 22 uh, 20 penetrations. I did my damn part. 1,540 XP on a loss. Almost double the next closest player, and he did good. The E75, the two E75s, 3,600, 3,300. The AMX squirty gunny at the end, he did alright. But there's your Tiger 2, he got a thousand damage. The other guy there, Freeze Turkeys, 285 damage. Nodka, 391 damage. They're the three that sat on the other side of the hill and did absolutely nothing the whole game. Um, the VK45 died really quick, he went to the wrong side of the rocks. I'm not going to fault him that much. Uh, the SU-101 I don't think did anything. And he sat up on the hill, but, you know, he should be up on the hill, but... Ugh. The SU-152 is one of them did good, the other did crappy. I mean... Teams like this is just, it's constant, it's just so annoying sometimes, but... I know, I guess you just gotta deal with it, right? As usual, comment, rate, subscribe, give me a thumbs up or a thumbs down, tell me what they did right, tell me what they did wrong, and... Tell me your stories about your teams lately. How have they been to you? Been getting good games or bad games? Because tonight went all bad for me. <laughs> Remember, you know that battlefield?